do you still need a website even if you're selling on social media that's the question that i'm going to help you answer in today's video hi i'm shreya sharan pawar i'm the founder of the women preneur academy and i help women entrepreneurs build and grow an online business i've created this video because sometime back i did a poll and i asked people if they have a website and i also asked a lot of people who've been messaging me on my dms on instagram and i was really surprised to know that most people most people don't have a website and i was like why a website is so important and it is so so easy to build so i took a decision to do this tutorial for all of you to help you build an online uh, website for yourself i'm going to teach you how you can build a fully functional online store using insta mojo which is india's largest payment gateway provider and they also help small businesses create beautiful online websites so over the next couple of days i'm going to give you one tutorial every day and i'm going to walk you through what you need to do to create your own website so in just less than 15 minutes a day you will have a fully functional a wonderful website which will you know which will be uh something that you're extremely proud of and i promise you it will take your business to a whole different level altogether okay so let's take a look at why you need a website in the first place even if you're selling on social media see the first and foremost it a website helps you stand out and what do i mean by stand out see there are a lot of other brands out there who might be selling the similar kind of products or offering the similar kind of services as you offer right when you have a website it allows you to showcase a different dimension of your brand a different dimension of your work there is so much more that you can add onto your website you can have detailed product descriptions you can add a video walk throughs you can add a beautiful video catalogs you can also have a lot of information about your brand in the various pages on your on your website and all of this really helps to add that extra something that sets you apart from all the other brands in your you know in in your line of work the second reason is that you know it's just so much more professional and and i say this all the time that a website is like having your own showroom if you don't have a website it's like you know you're like a tailor okay <laughs> so you don't want that for yourself okay you don't want that for your brand right that is why you need a website and having a website is is really important because uh when you come across as looking more professional it helps to build that trust your customers will trust you more and that will encourage them to go ahead and buy from you the third reason that you need to have a website is that it helps you get found and when you have a website it allows you to get discovered on more platforms so say like getting found on uh, google search results so you have uh, you have a uh, search engine optimization that can only happen in your website which will which can help increasing your discoverability so people who are not following you on social media can also find your work and if they like it they will go ahead and shop for it and what does this result in this results in more orders right more orders and more money now when you're getting more money why would you say no to that right so that's that's also a very powerful reason why you need a website and the re one reason why you know which is my personal favorite and why you know and why i i am such a huge proponent for having your own website is that it makes everything very simple it simplifies simplifies the order processing system for you because when you build an online store say using insta mojo you can do simple things like shipping the shipping your order directly through the store itself like it's just a one click thing you'll be able to print out your shipping labels the shipping request will be sent automatically to your uh, courier provider and a request to them and they will come and they'll pick it up from your uh, place so that really makes it extremely simple not just for you but also for your customers because when you when they come to your website they have all the information that they need right there and then right they don't have to constantly keep dming you for it or uh, you know look here and there for that information and that 
helps them make very very quick decisions about uh, which is which product do they want to buy and i'm sure that you've noticed this over over time that the kind of questions that you receive are very similar right now here's a suggestion for you you could simply add them as a detailed faq on your website so that any new person who comes who you know who comes to your page she can go through it and and uh, you know using those faqs make an informed decision now i know a lot of people have so here's in overall these are these are the five main reasons why you need to have a website now i also wanted to break some myths a lot people have a lot of myths about building a website so i wanted to also address those before i dive into the tutorial a lot of i've heard a lot of people say to me that they will build a website only once they grow or they build uh, the business is at a specific stage now it could be anything you know you could be earning 50000 rupees a month or some people have a target okay I, you know once i start hitting uh, earning say 1 lakh rupees a month i'll i'll create a website but here's the thing a website will allow you to reach those targets okay a website is is what will help you get at that level so a website is not something that you create after you reach the level the website is the tool that will help you help you reach whatever your final objective is whatever your final goal is okay so that is why you need a website not when you are when you are fully grown you need it at the initial stages and the sooner that you uh, create a website the better it is going to be for your business the second myth that i hear a lot is that it's expensive and i promise you this is not expensive so with insta mojo you can create a very robust website for just 7500 rupees a year that is it that's about 8 rupees a day that is all and if you use my link which i'm going to be putting here in the description below you'll get 1000 rupees off so effectively your website will just be for 6500 rupees annually that is it so it is definitely not expensive because when you go in for this you don't need to spend anything extra buying hosting or uh, and insta mojo also gives you a free domain when you sign up for their growth plan so that is why it is absolutely inexpensive and it really is you know there is so financially it really cannot be a reason for you to not have a website anymore the third myth that i hear people uh, say a lot is that i'm not technical or you need to be extremely technical and i promise you i promise you it's that is definitely not the case because creating a website with insta mojo is so simple in less than 15 minutes a day i'm going to help you make a website okay so here's the plan starting from starting from uh, 16th to 21st of this month i'm going to be putting up one tutorial every day which will guide you on the various steps that you need to take to to not, not just build your online store but also to make it extremely efficient and to integrate your shipping service with it i'm going to walk you through all of it okay so mark these days in your calendar and if you're watching the recording of this i'm going to create a playlist where you will find all of these videos so that you can go through them even later on so If you are going to be joining me in this series if you're going to take this up as a challenge that by 21st you will have a fully functional website I want you to put in your name in the in the comments below and just type i accept the challenge okay i am extremely excited about doing this with you i am extremely excited about seeing your websites because because i know all of you are so creative and and building a website is actually extremely creative and i i promise you once i show you how to do it you will fall in love with creating websites so once again starting from 16th till 21st i'm going to be releasing one small video every day it's just going to be about a 10 to 15 minute video uh, with an entire uh, where i will show you all the basics from which is the plan that you need to choose how do you how do you link your domain to the website how do you add different products to your website and everything 
that you need to ensure that you have a fully functional, a robust website by the end of 21st. Okay, so I look forward to seeing you in this challenge and I look forward to seeing all of your websites and I will see you on 16th with the first tutorial. Bye. Oh, also, if you've been with me here till now, do consider clicking on the subscribe button and hitting the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of the videos that are going to be coming up as a part of this series. So that's all for me for today and I will see you on 16th. Bye.